Hi guys, it's Nicole Lorenzo, and tonight I am going to be doing an iconic rock and roll guitar, Eddie Van Halen's Frankenstrat, or Frankie, or as he would call it, Baby. Um, I'm also doing a um, kind of a celebration of life remembrance for a friend of mine, Edward Mark Sawyer III, that passed away around this time this year, and also as well for um, the creator of the guitar, Eddie Van Halen. Um, it's taking me a few days to be able to actually do this because I don't want to get emotional <laughs> um, on here. Uh, and also, I'm down a uh, computer, so I didn't really have visual aid <laughs> to do it with. And I'm a very visual person, so I needed visual aid. I've drawn the guitar now like six times, <laughs> but I needed something that I could actually look at that was the exact um, guitar. So, now I'm ready to do this. Um, I'm going to um, do this probably in several different segments because this is going to take a while. When I did the Prince portrait, I did not think that was going to turn out as well as it did. So, I didn't tape it. Um, and I think it took over two hours, maybe three um, in all. So, this is bigger than that, and also, um, and so I'll, I'll probably, I'm definitely going to be pausing the video a good amount of times, but I'll probably, <laughs> obviously, section it out. The full thing will be on YouTube, there will only be, you know, excerpts and stuff on um, Instagram and Facebook as well. So, um, you can come back and join me. I have all kinds of fun, fascinating facts about this guitar. Um, because it was basically, well, he basically, Eddie Van Halen basically revolutionized guitars. Um, he was the one that started people tinkering on his guitar and was a creator of quite an amazing guitar. He was a tone chaser. So I've got the whole story of the guitar and, and quite a few other things that, um, I know about the band. I like to do research on stuff like this. So, um, plus I had actually painted this pattern over 16 years ago as a gift to Mark for taking him to the concert. So it was just fitting for me to do the guitar. Um, but yes, come back and join me or look for the second segment. Um, it'll be up after I do the body, I guess, of it. I'm going to go through my method behind my madness because this is a little different than just the regular fluid art just a little because there's paint on here that's not going to move so and i think it's just really cool to show this process because it's different i do music um appreciation is what i call it um as part of my art to just give back to the musicians all that they've given to me and just to show my appreciation for what they do and then just how beautiful music actually is. So um, come back and join me and I hope to see you guys again soon. 